Stoke-on-Trent pottery makers have suffered in recent times. I went to the Maiden Staffordshire exhibition in Stoke to see how industry experts are helping local businesses. What we're looking for today, this one is about making sure that the supply chain for the ceramic industry understand the manufacturers and the manufacturers work with the supply chain locally as well. Potentially there's the opportunity to create jobs, but from today there won't be many jobs, I don't think straight away, but there could be some for the future. We've been thinking about the event for a while, um, with several, um, several key firms going into administration recently. That was the catalyst we needed to really get manufacturers and suppliers talking together to strengthen the supply chain. We've got a critical mass of supply chain here in the UK and we want to keep it that way. We want to make sure um, people know where to do business, where the suppliers are. I think today is to just put, put uh, Stoke-on-Trent, Staffordshire, uh, and all the companies that are, are, are represented today to meet and to say that Stoke-on-Trent is basically still alive. I just feel that this, this can be the beginning of a biennial or something like that where the Stoke-on-Trent Staffordshire companies can get together and hopefully drum some business again like we did years gone by. I think this is the way forward. The small the company, the big pot banks and that have gone now. I think this is the way forward. The small industries that can specialise in doing specialist work for, for the small for people so I think they've one specialist work done. Some companies are suffering um, in the recession too. So for them it's about um, you know consolidating what what can we do as a trade association to help them through. And this is why today is also quite important for them to help provide some practical agency support through Business Link, um, through Chamber of Commerce, so that they're aware of all the, um, the support available to help business survive the recession. Stall Moses hopes to make these events annual, and with exhibitions like this, the future looks more stable for local pottery firms in Stoke.